Hello, Disney friends. Today, we are going to be looking at some pins. Yes, I have some new pins that have come in and I can't wait to share them with you. Um, I have, of course, some special guests here. We have got a Sandy washing herself. <laughs> and, oh, of course, we have Tinkerbell. Hello, Tink, hello. So yeah, I have some kitties that will probably be moving about here and there. Um, but yes, let's let's get into pins. Yes, I have got some pins that have come in. I am so excited. And the first one that we are going to be looking at is from Far, Far Away. So I'm going to... the This pin is from Japan. So it's Japan licensed because Japan um, owns Tokyo Disney. And because Japan owns it, it is licensed through Japan, not Disney. I know, isn't that interesting? Um, so yeah, so here it is. I'm so excited. I saw this one earlier and was kind of like kicking myself for not buying it. So then I was like, I reached back out and I said, you know, I think I want that pin. So here we have it. It is so beautiful, but we have Marie. Oh, look, oh, bonjour. Bonjour, it is Marie. And there's a pin on pin. So Marie is in front. And then the back, of course, has the bonjour. It is so cute. I love this pin. It's got some shimmer in there. But yeah, this is a beautiful pin of Marie. I was so excited. So like their, their cards, I noticed are a little bit different. Of course, it has Disney here. But on the back, they're, what usually is on their card. This is what the back looks like, what their back of their pin looks like. So again, they still have the Disney logo for Disney, but then they have this because they're from Japan and it's again, it's Japan licensed. But again, pin on pin and it is so pretty. Look at her. Ah, I love this pin. I really do. And I'm so glad I finally was like, you know what? I'm getting it. So, yep came in it's so cute so again i just love how it says bonjour all right i am french so <laughs> this pin was calling me <laughs> i actually have one similar to this <clears throat> but unfortunately i went through a very hard time and i ended up having to sell it um but this one is really cool so this one right here is bell and it says bell right here see look at that isn't it beautiful? So I actually had an aerial one like this a long, long time ago. But again, I don't have it anymore because a long time ago when I had bought it, I had to let it go. Um, but yeah, it's this one is so pretty. So this one is a Disney auction pin. And how you know that's a Disney auction pin is because you have the little gavels up here in the corner and all over. So yeah, so you'll see these little gavels. That's a Disney auction pin. They don't make these anymore. They are very, very old. Um, but this one's a limited edition of 1,000. And again, they had different princesses. And they had their names. This one see how it says Belle. They had the princess with them. But yeah, these were so pretty. Ah, I need to hunt down an Ariel again. Because <laughs> looking at this one makes me realize I really, really, really want the Ariel again. Um, but yeah, when I had showed my friend, she was like, oh, could you give me that one? I was like, yeah, of course. Um, but yeah, it's just because I have happened to know them. Um, but yeah, they have different ones. They have Cinderella. I have seen uh, Aurora, um, Jasmine. Uh, I know they have Ariel Summers out there. Um, and then there's Belle. But yeah, you could probably hunt down and probably find them. They're not going to be cheap. Um, they're much older again. Um, Disney auction pins are older pins, so you'd have to to look through and see what they had. So I also recently bought uh, quite a few pins from Pink Alamode, and recently they have all just seemed to have come in at once. Because you know when you buy from Pink Alamode, most of the time they're pre-ordered, and then they will let you know when they're you know make it to Pink Alamode and they ship them out. So I got like a whole bunch of different shipments all at once. So I will show you some of the different pins that I have picked up. Um, it's Kevin. Yes, there we have it. We have Kevin. She is in stained glass. Oh, so pretty. I have to get Kevin. I just love Kevin. I get so excited when I go to Animal Kingdom and Kevin is around. 
I'm like, oh, you're such a beautiful bird. <laughs> so friendly, comes right up, to chats with you. <laughs> but yeah, she is awesome. So I was really, really excited. And again, these are stained glass. And I do believe they have different ones for Pixar. An edition of 300, which is really teeny tiny in the back. Very small. Um, but again, if you can see, it is stained glass. You can see my hand behind it. Oh, stained glass. But look at her. She's so pretty. I do usually examine these really well because sometimes there are like slight bubbles in them. But looking at this one, this one's actually, I don't see any any arrows in it. So that's really awesome. So this is a good one. Now seeing this one, you know, I know they used to have an aerial one too. And I didn't pick it up at the time because I wasn't sure. Because I do love these. I think these are really cool. So this one right here is the Evil Queen. And again, it's a limited edition of a 300. You see, the, see the, the face in here? It's a bubble. See that? It sticks out. So these do really well if you want to put them like on a board. But if you're going to, you can't really stick these in the books. Because this sticking out this far is not going to do well. Um, you're not going to be able to close your book, depending on what type of book you have. So that's why it's like, I wasn't sure about getting the aerial one, but look at the Evil Queen one. That is beautiful. But this would look really good if you're going to stick it like on a board and put it up so you can look at them. And what's really cool is this one's got three prongs. Three! I'm thrilled they have two, but three? Oh, this one's awesome. And I do believe they still have this one online, too, so... If you're looking for these, I think there's a couple different ones. I think they have Tiana, the Evil Queen, and I think they have two more. And if I remember right, some of these haven't sold out yet. So if you're interested in something like this, it's, again, these are really kind of cool with the bubbles. And they look, again, they look really good on boards, but you're just not going to be able to put them if you have a book. So we have, I had to get this one. I saw this one. I actually saw the Marie one too, and I wasn't quick enough. Um, but I was really glad to snag this one. So this one right here. Look at this one. This is one of the, one of the Dalmatians. Again, limited edition of 300. But look at the shimmer on him. So much shimmer going on. I love it. The little crown. And this gold plated going around. It's so nicely detailed. So cute. I was like, ah. Oh, I love. I just love the detail. Printed. This is printed on. Along with, like, if you look here, you get little paw prints going up. These are also printed on, too, with the eyes and stuff. So that's kind of cool. I did not know that. Really, really cool. I like this pin. This pin is very different. And they had this one. I know they have Bambi. And then they had Marie. And Marie was, like, gone. <laughs> Just gone. Dragon. I know everyone's probably going like, I've seen this one. Yes, because it was part of the set. But look at the dragon. I do like the fact this is marble. So this is like all marble behind Melissa Fed the dragon. Which I think is really, really pretty. And then again here, all going all the way down is purple. Now, <laughs> interesting story about the dragon. Um, I bought it because ever, I knew I knew the dragon would go out really, really fast. Really fast. And I kept thinking, like, oh, I do like it. But I knew I had other friends that were interested. And I, I knew they probably wouldn't be quick on the button. Um, because they were all trying to go after different ones. So, yeah. This this was fun to try to snag. And I, am, um, I had a friend who kind of missed out. So I was like, oh, guess what? You're all set. Because I was quick. <laughs> but look at this. Look at this sparkles in this and the wings of is gorgeous and again look at the little details all around here again when you're after pink lmo pins you have got to be quick there are some that you can like it's okay like if you get there a few minutes probably gonna still be there but some of these are going to go fast melissa fit the dragon she's going to go fast so you have to be quick marie quick. I mean, there are certain characters out there that if you're not fast enough, it's gone within seconds. Um, I think there was a recent one that I was looking at. I think it was a stitch with the ducks and at 7 o'clock, 7.01, it was already gone. So I missed. 
<laughs> it was okay because I was like, all right, it wasn't meant to be. When, when I do miss out, I'm like, it's just not meant to be. I did. I did think outside the box for this one because I, everyone knows, I collect the cats and dogs of Disney. Like, I just love cats and dogs of Disney. So I was just like, I need to get these. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to buy them all. <laughs> so I did. So I had all the animals. Remember all the animals that came out all at once? So I had gotten them, all of them. All of them. And I'm so excited. So here, let me try to get them out of the plastic really fast. And I will show you guys each one that I had gotten. So again, this is Bernese and Tutsuro. I can't say their names. I'm sorry. But it's, it's the brothers of Marie. But look at them. Oh, they're on the little straw hat. I do, do love these. If I remember, I think these are a limited edition of 500. Yes. So in the back of these, it'll say 500. So limited edition of 500 down here. And again, it's it has a thing that says Disney. So even though Pink Alamo creates them, they're still licensed through Disney. So these are not fancy pins. These are licensed through Disney. But look at that. It's so cute in the straw hat. So most of these are all limited edition of 500. All right. YouTube, look. This one is Patch. He's on the books. Isn't he cute? Again, he's a limited edition of 500. And he's on the books. And they all shimmer. So, so pretty. And all these will say special edition at the bottom. You notice last year they all said limited edition, but things have changed. So their pins are now special editions. But look, so, so cute. Ah, and again, these are all exclusive to Pink Owl Mode. And again, I got them all. So if you remember these, seen them online and they sold out really fast, I just was like, you know what? I'm not gonna play around, I'm just gonna grab them all. So I did. And of course I had to get Figaro, so there he is. Look at him, he's so cute. I just love kitties. So yeah, he's a doll. Again, I was just like, I have to get him. So he's gonna go really good in my figure row collection. Oh, and then I am doing uh, a board. Dinah. So I was like, oh, look at Dinah. Now I thought it was interesting. All of these, I've noticed, are on this backer card. Except Dinah. She's the only one <laughs> that is on this one. And I do know that this is definitely the back of card for Alice in Wonderland, but I just thought that was interesting that for this pin set that came out, she's the only one on this backer card. All the other ones are on the blue backer card. Found that very interesting. But uh, but I do know when it comes to the Alice collections, this is their backer card. But um yeah. Limited edition again of 500 and this one again was all sold out. This is so cute. I love cats and dogs. I'm so excited to get these. And then, of course, this one sold out really fast. So we have Marie. Look at her on her little pillow. Again, another limited edition of 500. Look at her sassiness. Ah, oh, she's so pretty on her pillow. I do love these. These are so pretty. And then, <laughs> of course, for my dogs, they had this dog, and I was like, oh, it's perfect because he's going to be going on the board with Dinah. I'm kind of splitting them up. But we have Nana. So there's Nana. So pretty. Look at there, the little thing. A little bonnet. But again, she's another special edition. So yeah, I do. I always put these two on the board. I have a board, and I'm gonna have these two together on it. So right now, I have been collecting these two pins of these characters together. And actually, it's coming along pretty well. So I'm actually really excited. We're gonna see how that goes. <laughs> and along with that came this one. And Oliver again is another special edition. <laughs> so poofy, Looks like he just got a bath. This is what my cats look like when they've got wet. The cats don't like getting wet, if you can tell. His expression is not happy. Not happy. Uh, but this one, again, is a limited edition, if I remember right, of 500. Yep. Limited edition of 500. He's just on a blue background. So it's just blue around him with the silver. 
and just not a happy not a happy kitty in that one now along with that one i also got this one now this is was, i think this is a part of the expression series so they have a series right now of just expressions of different animals um and this one was also a part that came with it so this is eeyore and this one again went really fast but i do love the background of these it's like inside has like flowers and it's like pink going around but this one came when you bought all of them so you could buy all of the animals together or you could buy the animals with this one and it had like a slight deal so i grabbed this one because my mom loves eeyore she loves Winnie the Pooh in the gang, but her favorite is Eeyore, and then it's Pooh and Piglet. Um, but yeah, so I was like, I'm gonna get this for her, so she's gonna love this. This one actually is a limited edition of 300. If you wanted this one alone, it was like $35, but again, if you got them all, it was like a slight deal, so I grabbed the deal set. That's what I kinda like about Pink Elmo, they kinda like, you can get them individually, but those will go fast. Or you can try to get them in like collections. So sometimes they'll have like like a set where you can just get them all at once. So if you want them all, that's like the best way to go about it. But oh, he's so cute. Oh, it's gonna look so good in my mom's collection. I do really like this one. And if you thought I was done, you are wrong. I have more. <laughs> it just keeps going. Um, let me see. So this was one I picked up, it's so cute. So I have been collecting a little small uh, collection of Gigi from Kiki's Delivery Service because I do love the movie and I did see this pin, I have another pin. So you might see this year a couple of Gigi's come through. Earlier, you were doing fine, oh there we go. Uh, but love the spark, I love this one because it had such cool little sparkles in Gigi and I just thought that was so cute. Now this is a very small little pin, if you can tell by my finger. It's only like maybe an inch or so high, but it's adorable. Oh, and look, there's Kiki up there on her, her little broom flying overhead. But yeah, I just thought this was adorable. So I snagged it. So cute. So this will be going part of the little collection that I'm starting. So again, this year you'll probably see a couple of those. This. <laughs> I'm trying to collect these. Um, I think I'm only missing one now, but then I turned around and bought more boxes, so I don't know. <laughs> I'm probably gonna have like a whole bunch. Um, but yeah, I don't know if anybody else is out there collecting this. This is the train of the princesses. Um, and I have been trying to collect them. And I just cannot seem to get this one. But finally, I just bought it. I was just like, you know what? I've given up. <laughs> I plead the fifth. But then I turned around and bought like more boxes. So I don't know. Um, watch me now get this one. It'd be so funny. But, um, so yeah, I got Snow White. Because Snow White was the one I was missing. I don't normally, again, collect Snow White. But if I see a series like this, and I do want all of them, because I want to collect all of them, and I can't find a trade, I will just buy it. So this one I bought because I was just worried that I was not going to be able to get her. Um, so yeah, she is part of that collection. I'm only missing one now, and it's Belle. I need a bell. Um, and I can't seem to get it. <laughs> I don't know. Um, so we shall wait and see. I do, I'm just hoping if I can just get, I just need to get one, one bell for me. Um, so I can finish that train set. Um, and then along with that, I also got this pin. This pin is so cute. Um, I have saw this pin a couple times and I just realized that I just need to have it. Uh, if I can get it out. But it is it's adorable. It's like it's back in 2020, which I didn't get really many pins in 2020. Um, but again, it's Dinah. And I just think she's adorable. And it's like a little bit of glitter here. But look, I'll get up close. But look at the little, it's, she's so cute. But again, I want to see if I can finish and like work on that board. And I just thought this one was so cute. But I do, it's right here. It does say it's in 2020. But yeah, just, this is adorable pin. She's so cute. Such a cute little kitty. And I don't really collect much of Alice in Wonderland. But I, I just love the cat so much. Um, cause I, I love cats. 
This is why I collect cats. I have cats. Um, so yeah. I also have a dog too. He's down on the floor. Um, he's like 15 years old. His name's Stitch. Um, so he doesn't get seen very often. Um, he sleeps most of the days now. Ah, he's my old man, I call him. <laughs> All right. So I got this one. Because I also have a small little set of the happiest celebration on earth. That was back in like 2004, 2005. Um, so I do have like a little tiny collection of that going. So I want to get this because this was the bus. See? And they actually have more buses. I don't know if anybody remembers this collection. There were actually five. Five of these buses that came out back then. And you could sometimes get them for free. And the reason why you got them for free was because you you would like get them as like a like a surprise and you get two on a paper it was weird like a little paper thing and it had like two of the of um these little buses so you could have one and you could share one <laughs> i know i wish i would do that now because at one point the bus kind of like they painted the bus to look a little bit like that with a little bit of sparkle so i thought that was really cool i thought i could add to that collection because i do have some pins from that um, time period where they did this happiest celebration on earth. Um, <clears throat> once I finished that, that's where that big castle that I have comes from. It's also part of that series. So once I finish that, I'll get to show you guys. Cause I think that'll be looking kind of cool. So I saw this pin. I just think it's adorable and I had to have it. Um, this was back in, this pin came out in like 2017 and there's more in the series and I'm probably going to see if I can continue to get some of these from the series. So I have a pretty cool little Bambi collection going on and this is probably one of the Bambi pins and I saw it and I was like, oh, so cute. And they go for more now. Um, I even like the backer card. I mean, look at the backer cards, really pretty too. But this again was for like the 75th anniversary. And this again is a limited edition. It's a limited edition of three, 3,000, but I want to show you. So this is Bambi in the puddle. Remember when he's in the puddle? And then look, look what comes out. <laughs> I thought that was so cute. And she like goes back and forth. Ah, oh, she's adorable. Oh, I just love this. I thought that was so, so fun. I thought that was like a cute little scene in the movie too. I think there's like a, yeah, she like just comes back and forth. And there's like a little cattails. There's like little cattails on top over here and like, where she comes out, see the little cocktail, but then it kind of like disappears because she pops out. Again, adorable. She's adorable. I love Feline. She's like so cute. She's like, boop, hello, boop, aha. <laughs> I do know there's a couple more in this series and I'm probably gonna see if I can eventually get them so I can like put them in a row. Cause there was one where I think I saw flower and he's like under a rock and you can actually lift up the rock and there's flower underneath it and it's Bambi and I think Thumper's on that one too. But again, there's some different ones and I just think they're so cool because they each have like a moving or like open element. And I love those. I love anything that moves. Like I love pins that like do things or shimmer or glow or, but again, I just thought that was so cute that she pops in and out. I also did a trade. I did trade with Alexandria from Alexandria's Magical World. <laughs> and what we traded um, for was at the time, and I, at the time I was missing Aurora, and she was missing um, Cinderella, I think is what I gave her. Um, but now I have Princess Aurora, so now I have two Princesses Aurora. <laughs> I, who knows, I'll probably have more. Um, cause again, I have more boxes coming in, but cause I really, I really need, I really need Belle, but there she is. So pretty. Again, you also guys let me know in the comments below if you're collecting the series, cause I think I'll have plenty left over <laughs> that can help anybody else that is struggling to finish these. Um, but again, thank you so much, Alex, for, for trading with me. That was really awesome. Uh, I love trading with you. You know, we'll have, have to trade again in the future. Um, but again, she, she collects pins too. And I will put her link down below if you want to go and check her out. She collects a lot of pins and she has a lot, a lot of Jim Shores. Love her Jim Shores. Right. Yeah. So now I did quite a haul at Box Lunch. Yes, I did. I did a lot, a lot of getting pins for Box Lunch. 
Lots of pins. I will show you the pins. We shall look at them. Um, I also got these, and of course, I'll probably do these in a short. So you'll probably see a short come up. But I thought these were so pretty. So these are more of those key keychain ones. And I do love this one. Look at them, all the princesses. Ah! So I grabbed two of these. So again, this will probably come up in a short. Um, <laughs> I did grab two more of the princess train boxes. <laughs> so hopefully, hopefully one of these are Bell. Please be a Bell. Please be a Bell. Um, and then I grabbed some pins. So let's to show you. <laughs> is uh, Marie and her brothers. So there they are. And I thought these were really cute because of they ha like this feel. This is a different type of feel. It's like, um, like a rubberized feel for the yarn. So I thought that was really cute. And I just love her. I love her and her brothers together. They're so cute. Uh, and I do know their names. I just have a hard time saying their names. <laughs> Just how it is. Um, and the weird part is, is I'm French and I still have a hard time saying their names. I don't know how many times I've asked Google their names and I still have a hard time saying it. So maybe one of these days I'll catch on. I don't know. And then here, um, I had grabbed this one for my youngest. She's a big Frozen fan. And I do know she'll love this pin. It's almost kind of makes me think of like, almost like a poster. It's like a poster one. But yeah, she actually has this. She actually has in Lego form and she built it. She's only, she was like six years old when she built it. I was really impressed. <laughs> but yeah, she saw this pin and she's like, I need to have that for my Frozen collection. I'm like, okay. So she'll get that one. And then my oldest one, my oldest daughter saw this one. And we all know my oldest daughter loves Jasmine. So when she saw this, I went and got it for her because I knew she loved it. I have the aerial one of this one and there's a couple other ones on there. But my, my oldest daughter is a big Jasmine fan. So we grabbed that one. I saw, I saw this one. And this one's so beautiful. Look at the colors. I don't normally get some of these. Just because I like normally ones with, you know, their faces and stuff on it. But I did love the look of this one. And I love the colors and the different blues in the background. And the bubbles are kind of kind of cool too. They really look like little little white like bubbly forms which i thought was kind of cute but yeah it's actually a very very beautiful pin i do like the fact that her castle's like behind her too but yeah so i grabbed that one this one was also grabbed i thought this one was really really pretty again i have a feeling this will probably be going to my youngest because she's also a big big fan of tangled and just loves rapunzel too so I do love this one with her and her lantern because I love Pascal. And this one has little Pascal too. So I do like the fact that it ha has her very well detailed in this one. This one's really pretty. But yes, again, little Pascal. He's so cute. Ah, just love. I mean, again, they're both very, very pretty. There was a, there was a third one, um, but I had just grabbed these two. But again, here they are, both of them. So it's kind of like, almost like a series. Because they both go very well together. Both really pretty. Alright, I grabbed Aurora. There she is. She is sleeping. So soundly. This one is so pretty. Let's look at the flowers around her. This is a really pretty pin. I wasn't. I grabbed it and I wasn't sure. I not really do. I have a really teeny tiny like collection of aurora pins but most of the time it's like a briar rose or when she is wearing the blue dress um but i do like i do like the look of this pin this one is really really pretty i love how her hair is kind of flows but it has the flowers down here going up and around that one is really pretty with a little with a, just enough little like sparkles right here with the little stars that is really cool i do like this all right. Well, that was a lot of pins today. Hoo -ha! But we did it. We did it. We got through it. We got to see it all. I got it all here. So again, you'll have to let me know in the comments below what you guys thought of this haul. 
Uh, if you have any of these pins, are we pin twins? Um, do you buy from any like Pink Elmo? mode? Do you, do you buy any of your pins from Box Lunch? Um, are you trying to finish any of the series? I know how it's like to try to finish collections. It can be tough. Like the train one. I just need a bell. <laughs> uh, um, but again, thank you guys for hanging out with me. We love having you here. Me and my wonderful little family. They're all sleeping over here. <laughs> that, this one's so... Nope, this one's awake. <laughs> all right. Well, take care. And I hope to see you guys again in the next video. All right. Bye now.